Welcome, welcome everybody. Today is what? 14th May 2024. Welcoming you aboard with my co facilitator Umesh Lal Chandani, me Radna Tiwari facilitating and looking forward to clear diseases. So, thank you for giving us this opportunity and everything we say here, be, and all the point of view that we're going to give is just our interesting point of views, guys. Uh, these are the all our knowing what we've learned and from that how several result we are getting um we were very excited to share that uh, we don't guarantee anything here uh, it is your knowing that you have to guarantee and you have to go with your own knowing yet whatever we could both um uh, get into and know about it and we have been working with a lot of people uh separately umesh has been working on his own i've been working on my own and it's just yeah that we both let's get together and what the mal we can be to each other <laughs> what, yeah. uh, what uh, <laughs> invitation can we to the world so anything that works for you guys take it just by your awareness don't just trust because Aradna is doing or Amesha is doing uh, we are not we are not certified doctors or stuff yet what our knowing of this world is we are here to share and Umesh has been a uh, is in a, a bus facilitator with access and a hypnotherapist and what else <laughs> what else <laughs> Umesh will <laughs> For intro for himself. Over to Umesh. Well, thank you. Thank you for such a wonderful introduction. My and mother for call and for my also. And hello and welcome all. Thank you for joining. And I'm super excited to co facilitate with you with this light and you come to. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Everybody, we would really request you guys to be on camera. Then it's more fun to talk and it's kind of more honoring for each of us. Uh, I am sure if you guys cannot be, I totally get it. But let's honor each other with being on the cameras. That feels us being more welcomed and be with you. Otherwise, it just feels like, no, you know, you don't want us. You just want to put us on the sideline, not hear us. We can try. <laughs> Everything that is, can we let that go? Thank you and thank you and thank you. Yes, we are talking about diseases. We are coming with the series of different diseases that we will be talking about in the last. But yes, uh, what is diseases? Um, I will give you my take and let I'll I think I'll ask Umesh first to today give the take and let's change it. Not women first, men first. So let uh, Umesh say what uh -huh. you are thinking about. <laughs> And then we will talk more about it. And if you have questions, we will take your questions after that. Yeah. Go ahead, Rupesh, please. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> so, just to start with, what I believe and what how I work is that everything is just a reflection of our inner world. From a needle, even needle can't strike. If a needle striking in our body or in our hand is just a reflection of our thoughts, somewhere we are not congruent with. And whether it's allergy, whether it's disease, even from birth to death, we choose everything, and everything is showing as a reflection of our inner world, of how we are thinking, what we are choosing, and all the diseases are whatever is happening, whether diseases, whether allergies, is just. Uh, showing us is kind of a way of communication how our body is how our body communicates with us and to add to that yes the uh, what i also get that is uh, there is a language a body has so we are all in a spherical shape of the uh, molecules and the moment something comes it pressures and it changes the shape and it loses its shape and it kind of in the body or the physical body starts showing the elliptical way of it and uh, that is a sign of it showing that hey, here there is a discomfort in my body or here something is changing and shifting and it gives a very little knock it's like you know little light knock on your door and then it goes heavier and heavier and heavier when you're not hearing it out so then it becomes from a zero symptom to directly to a, a cancer stage or a you know dying stage where it is because we have not been hearing and there have been a lot of cases that I've heard and personally know where people are amazingly well disciplined and fine, you know, and they didn't even know till the last minute that something is going on in their body and they just went for a just a regular checkup and they happened to have a, you know, a last stages of their, that disease killing them. 
And I'm like, wow, what is that? And I've been really, really asking those questions. And I have so many friends who have been going through these diseases. And um, I have suffered. I've also been with people who had a lot of illnesses where I, where I was like, okay, we were treating illness. We were treating the disease rather than acknowledging what is that disease actually bringing and what actually made that disease enter that body. So I've, I've literally closely studied and, you know, it's also a lot of, uh, people into um, drugs, alcoholism and stuff. We pointed out that, oh, this is the reason, this is the re or the obesity, this is the reason of people dying. No, the reason is not that. There is a reason that a person has chosen something to, you know, maybe like out of fun, one says, oh, I'd rather die and fine. You think you're just joking and you just said it. No, but your body is so obedient it takes that every information, everything that you say, it comes to you. It makes it. And it's like, okay, marjate. it has no point of view. Okay, it is so sensitive. It is so simple. And um, then I, I actually met a friend of mine and she had different stages of cancer. And she's still uh, doing so much in her life. And when I met her for the first time in the tracks, I uh, acknowledged her and saw, like, I can't believe you ever had cancer. She said, yeah, I have fought it and I fought the thing. And there are a lot of other people in my community who have been having it in spite of doing all these access or doing of all the clearings. What I've realized is uh, sometimes if you do not catch it in time and you're not listening to your body, it can become, but it will gift you in a certain manner to live a life which you probably would have not lived if you did not have it. You would have probably lost your life into that and don't even come to know what life meant to you. So a lot of people have got the meanings of life through the diseases. But um, so I won't say disease is not a contribution. That is also in a contribution. Uh, yet, if you want to get rid of it, there is a lot of ways. There are a lot of uh, listening to your body, very lot of presence to your body and listening to the language of your body. And you will have to learn the language of your body. And how, where, when, that is the depth that we're going to talk and we are um, sharing our experiences, me and Umesh, then how we get. And uh, I mean, that's what I was just talking to Umesh uh, just before this call. And it was like how any disease happens to us. And uh, Umesh had a very amazing, uh, uh, you know, study there. So I would really like Umesh to talk about like thyroid, diabetes. Go ahead, yeah, uh, Umesh, please. Uh, yes. So I am, thank you for doing this. Thing. And I am working since la almost last more than a year. year. With, uh, the, especially these diseases, all the diseases, pains, addictions, and like that. And most of the common things I get is diabetes, thyroid, cancer, and migraine. Yeah. Uh, so, so malab, many. Of many diseases besides that also but these are the most common things across the years I keep on getting and as I said earlier ke every disease or pain or allergy is just an information whether it's addiction so yes. uh, malab, diabetes if I give you malab, share some examples is like ke, when diabetes happens the core of the diabetes is somewhere we choose to give up our happiness the moment we decided, not consciously, but subconsciously, something happened and we are emotionally so down and we had given up our happiness in that moment, even for just five minutes or 15 minutes, but we are emotionally so down that our mind accepts it and it, it makes it a reality. That's so we true. start creating with in that way. And so, immune is also, <laughs> autoimmune, somebody is asking, is also a... Uh, self-rejection to the core and especially yeah. these days the auto immune is really really a big disease it has yes, become a new yeah. stress yeah yes Umesh yeah. had on that yeah it is something that is undigestible whether it's experiences whether it's relations whether it's business wise or like that okay, that creates a lot of those things that which we hadn't thought of even Kind of so, in as we say, it is something we had never thought of. Kind of beyond. Yeah. So for, for a moment, also if it happens like it is beyond us, so we get that out. Yeah. Autoimmune diseases get triggered. So the thing is, it is like you know everybody is asking for their own specific spaces, and that is when we created this series of twelve calls where we will be talking about in detail about a particular disease and what does that actually mean and. 
it would be maybe we it's a 90 minute calls that we're coming up with and it's like uh we will pick up a person or we will talk about it we will go with the energy of the class it can be uh, you know who is required to take them to a hypnotherapy session i energetically take where it is and i think when me and Umesh generally work just within our team it's amazing because we just laugh and giggle and, you know, he'll be listening and he'll be asking questions and I would pick up and I'm like, okay. And when the people are answering and then they're stuck, I'm like, oh, he went to supper. You know, that is my yeah. capacity that I hold it and then Umesh takes them into the deeper zone. So, and that way we have been really been able to work a lot. Maybe we have not been able to change this, you know, what first thing comes with the obesity or the weight and the things when people work is, oh, I haven't lost the weight. <laughs> but yeah, we are still happy. We are still different. We have admitted and we have received our bodies as who we are. So if you think these things are going to make you thin and it is not the gym that you're going and you're running out of stuff, it will change your attitude towards it. So the thing is you have, you will die, you will do something. But how you live that life from here to Z to Z, you might be able to catch it, you may be able to change it. It depends upon how much you're willing to receive. But yes, we have seen a lot of wonderful results. People have cured. People have moved beyond their diseases. People have started walking. People who were, uh, you know, not able to sleep have started sleeping. And that has also happened with a lot with bars, of course. And yet, uh, private sessions, which has come, people who have had migraines forever and, you know, uh, blood pressure dealings and stuff. But people get so psyched. This is, it's not simple case ho sakta. Like, you know, a lot of cases I've seen with me also, and I'm sure it will happen with Umesh also. They go out of yeah. one session and they're fine. And they're like, to to lagai nahi mujhe problem thi. And then they're so insecure about it. Then they like actually catch it back and bring it back. So mm -hmm. we are talking, we're going into details of every uh, disease where it is, because this is a very small platform for right now for us to go and talk into detail of any a particular disease right now and that is why we thought that let's have it and i was very hesitant to do it because i was like you know i have this capacity and ability to first suffer it and then tell so i told my body <laughs> baby we are not suffering we know it as much as it's gonna come let's not do it after by afternoon i was about to cancel this and i was like no i'm not doing these calls Sorry, I'm not choosing to get into this trauma which people are choosing. And uh, then I, it was funny. My son was sitting next to me. He's like, no, you're not doing this. You're not doing this. We've really worked on it. <laughs> I'm like, I'm not falling sick for other people. I'm not here to fall sick. <laughs> and he says, what can you tell your body that, you know, that can actually help you gifting people this? I said, okay. And then I took like <laughs> half an hour. I said, okay, give me my space. And I slept. And then I woke up. I said, okay, I'm ready for it. And let's play with it. So wonder what it is all going to, I'm not going to go test into it. I just trusting my knowing and I just know that I know it. I am sure of that. How much can you trust your knowing to know that you, if this works for you, you're most welcome to join one particular call. You want to join the series of it because everything brings in some information. Yeah. Uh, that is what I had to say. If Umesh has to say something more, other, after that, we can take your questions. Yeah. 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 So just adding on to it, actually, whatever pains or diseases that are showing up, it's not a suffering. It is just where we are incongruent with ourselves. It it's not a wrongness. It is just we think we want this or we are choosing this, but unconsciously we don't want to choose that thing. We are thinking if we could choose this or the other thing. The other way, it will be better, but due to well, whether to sh maintain our image, whether to maintain well, whether from the fear of it yeah. or resistance to it, ke what other people will think or what the family will think, it is not right, it is not wrong, it is not perfect, or we don't want to take risk. So there are millions of things that we are insecure about and that shows in the form of pains, diseases, or like that and even addictions also are the form of okay, how, how and what we have associated with it we can get out of addictions too and, this, and end of the, the, I tell you guys like that. yeah sorry like how Umesh just brought the uh, addiction I have dealt with it the, the, 
any any sickness, any disease is an information. We have that addiction of making everything ours. So addiction is also a very interesting energy. And um, what if addiction is actually working for that person? As what amazingly we said that uh, we just choose those diseases and we may try, end up making their ours and that is the right way for us to follow the life and make the life out of it because we have bought those point of views on the journey that ye karenge to hum nikal lenge like how bachpan mein I used to take you sabko dekh ke ki aray chutti to tabhi milti hai jab koi peet mein dard hota hai ya sar mein dard hota hai ya koi bimar hota hai to chutti milti hai so I used to create that and then I was like oh god if this is called chutti I don't want a chutti I think I have a smart brain in my childhood. I said, I don't want to fall sick to get this chutti. i rather go to school and have fun. Okay. So, yes, a lot of people have asking about the hormonal imbalances, digestion issues, yes. and things. Of course, we are bringing up all these topics. And uh, I don't know if Shivangi is here and she has a whole thing. We will be sharing all these issues. There are a lot of, like, if we right now get, I know we all have different issues. And mm -hmm. uh, But end of the day, uh, we would really like to say one thing whatever those issues and imbalances in your lives are going on they are giving you some information they are talking to you so don't make yes you go with your medical uh, ailment I mean doctors hospitals and stuff and you know keeping yeah. but the moment you are I would really one thing if you don't even want any of, of you don't want to attend any of the classes we are happy we are okay with total allowance of it but one thing if you really want to take a take from here from the space today is what if you can actually be present with your bodies mm -hmm. listen make your body your best friend listen to what every change in your body is even a nerve flowing there's a liquid flowing in your body there is a discharge flowing in your body not from the space of the panic hey body what are you telling me what awareness is this is it something that and does it belong to me or am I, because you, we are so concerned with families and people around us with, you know, I remember ages back, I had this, um, because I always have a capacity of biome making people. And I was like, my friend went, had a little on a Diwali day, she had uh, some uh, fall and she broke her uh, foot and she couldn't move out on the Diwali dinners. And I'm like, oh shit, I know what she must be feeling through. I was so concerned when I was talking to her that I was in her world. And then I just wanted to understand what she's feeling. I created it. My, I used to tell my sister, oh my God, you got a pimple on your face. My, oh, I'm sure you must be feeling bad about it. Next morning, I used to have a pimple. Anything I have spoken to people, I have created in my life. And that is when I was really resistant today for coming <laughs> to this. But I'm like, okay, how can I use this to my advantage? And how can I make fun and use of it? And what can I, what if you, all of you were talking to me, I can actually send this in. And I was talking to the entity of the diseases that what if we can today listen, ask, you know, uh, tell people that they can listen to you mm -hmm. because you're trying to communicate to people in different languages, but people have made that as a disease and the wrongnesses and they are um, trying to throw you off rather than getting the information and throw you off. Mm -hmm. So any disease in your body is just an information flowing to you guys. So don't reject it. Okay. How to love and listen to the body so that it heals itself of any disease present in the body. Yes. Mm -hmm. Then how do you undo it? It's like by the acknowledgement. If you acknowledge that I am biomimicking or oh, I was doing it because my mother did it or I'm having, you know, I had a point of view in my childhood uh, that, you know, my mother did that or my, my uncle did that or my friend is doing that. Okay. Every when I'm doing this, I let, I choose to let go. You have to make that choice of letting it go. Mm -hmm. Acknowledgement is the key to the magic. And uh, whether you go through the hypnotherapy or do you go through our talks or the conversations. And having said that, then these are endless. You know, you can go to the past regression therapies, you can do the therapies and you can keep going endlessly into it. They will never end because you have lived in God's in lifetimes. But what are you choosing now in this very moment is a choice. And so ask your body how to how do I love you? Yeah. What does loving self look? Yes, go ahead. Nish, sorry. Yeah, completely. Try to add. Yeah, yeah, just ask your bodies. What is your way of showing love? What how, what can I be for you today? How can I take you for a date? What else is possible? 
every every itch, everything, body, what, and not making it yours, asking what is this? What can I do with you? Go ahead. Go ahead, Umesh. Yeah. And seeing as the malab, mentions, malab questions, they have mentioned, like, yeah. just addressing in one word, in a very yeah. short, ke how, when you come along with us, ke we will take you so deep to the core yeah. of it, not exactly everywhere, but main men pick up some this issue and go to the core of it in a way ke if, around which we ask questions and how to heal or cure or get out of it is like ke the things I show is hormonal imbalance, so yeah. body aches and acidity. As acidity it comes shows mostly jealousy. Somewhere we are holding jealousy. But how it might be, if you see it consciously, it might, it won't you, you might won't see that you are jealous of anything. But yeah. at somewhere, how you have hold it and what does jealousy means to you when we dive deeper. So you will realize that once it's cleared, so you will see, you will free, completely free from acidity. Correct. And hormonal imbalances, also you are not congruent with it, but mm -hmm. not stable somewhere you are thinking. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure about your choices or things. Or yeah. being irritated about someone in the family or close relationships, they are how the hell they can be like that. Yeah. Around I that, mean, the core of it is that. And yeah. knee, uh, knee is about pressure, how much pressure you are feeling. Around that thing again. Obesity is how much you are insecure about and fearful of. Vaginal discharge is how much pleasure you are avoiding. <laughs> Or dependent or on judging, pleasure. or judging, or yeah. judging the pleasure that you're having. Yes. So, uh, Infertility awesome. is about how ready you are. Are you really ready about it to get yeah. to conceive? Infertility and is a very so lovely many, topic. Yes. And it works like, like magic. And, yeah. And, and it's like so, so many people, even like, even I've worked with so many infertility patients, where really like people are doing it for the heck of showing that I am a poor, pathetic victim me. Uh, but actually, they really don't want to have a baby. And when they have cleared, then they are like, oh, maybe they're stuck from other lifetimes of not having a baby. But now they can make a different choice. And yeah. the allowance of it. The moment they have the allowance, oh, I really don't want to have. But it seems I'm doing everything. I'm going through the pain and aches and everything in my life. And I'm going through the IVFs and the injections and stuff uh, to get it. Um, it's like a it's it's become a job. The pleasure has gone out of the life. So you yeah. know, it's a doing thing. And how much fearful, uh, yeah. yeah. How much fearful we are of being mother. Oh, yeah. how what, uh, how many responsibilities are? Whether I'm yeah. going to be a good mother or not, there are millions of things around that. Yeah. yeah. I I remember long and, back I did one case and that lady had so much of inhibition because her aunt had some issues when she was a little baby. Mm -hmm. and you know and she was holding it from there and she had decided that she'll never have a child yeah. and I was like wow what an excuse where did she go and what ail she went you know deep down she went into it skin energy yeah. especially deeper is still <laughs> all self-judgment deeper <laughs> is all about self-judgment <laughs> yeah, because, because nobody I likes thought... people nobody loves people Guys, <laughs> uh, can I request whosoever is joining to be on uh, cameras? You would really be kind. i will be really kind of you guys. I love to see your lovely faces. Thank you and thank you and thank you whosoever is willing to join us. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So yes, we are gonna be these are gonna uh, Shivangi is here, I guess. So I just saw Shivangi. Shivangi, um, can you get give a little detail of what the program is? Then after that, we can take more questions from them and. <laughs> Just make me the ghost. Meanwhile, the you mean the ghost? Yeah, sure. yeah the ghost. You'll go, you'll you'll ghost. Us. The ghost is here already. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, welcome everybody. We are super excited about this series. We're uh, giving the introduction. Can you mute yourself, guys, when you're joining? Thank yes, you. yes, I'm Go muted. Ahead. So yes, welcome everybody. Yes, I came in late. I was getting my bars run. And how does it get better? Uh, no, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, Suraj, do you want to say something? I just wanted to say hi. Hi. Hello. <laughs> Thank you. Hi. Amazing. So uh, we are super excited about this. Uh, 
I mean, Aradhana's got these amazing powers of like tapping into the energy. And I was just discussing with a friend that Umesh is somebody who will just not leave you. Yeah. Like he will stay around till that like if you are hooked on to like this one aspect of your story, he will hook on to that aspect of your story with you and hold that space for you. So which is which is Beyond which is any. so full of love and compassion. Yeah. Um, so both of them coming together is such an excitement for us at Be The Change. Um, and I'll just quickly present to you all what we are coming up with. Um, can you guys see my screen? Can you guys see this? Give yes, me a thumbs see. up. Yes, yes we can okay. see. Amazing, amazing. So this is the series that we are coming up with. Uh, we are calling it Clearing Diseases. Um, and... Uh, the topics that we are going to cover are, so there are going to be 12, uh, no, there, yeah, there are going to be 12 calls uh, every 15th and 30th of the month. So we will begin from tomorrow and this goes on till October. So uh, we are clearing, the, uh, we are going to be clearing these topics, acidity, migraine, diabetes, thyroid, skin allergies, sciatica and joint pain, anxiety and depression, uh, infertility, menopause, menstrual pain. Then we have sleep paralysis, paralysis and Parkinson's, vertigo and panic attacks, cancer, aging. These are the different topics that we are covering. And here you will see the schedule of the classes. So these are going to be 90 minutes calls, guys. Uh, we, I mean, usually uh, the timing is going to be in the evening. Um, but if at all there are some timing changes, we will ensure that everybody in the group is comfortable with it. Uh, you can look for yourselves uh, if if there is a particular disease that you are looking at clearing for yourself or for a family member or for a friend or for your clients. Um, then uh, here's the schedule and you can look for which one falls where and in which month. Uh, as of now, we have an amazing offer for all of you, which is an early bird offer that if today you sign up, you've got the next three hours to sign up for any of the calls. You can sign up for any one or two or three of the calls and you get the call for 5300 per call. And if you go for the entire series, then you get it for 53000 Uh in case you don't choose in the next three hours, you will still have the option of choosing it whenever it comes. Uh, but the pricing is going to be different. It will be 8000 for single call and for the entire series, it's going to be 65000 Even if you have missed a previous call, you can still go for purchasing the entire series because we will share with you the call recordings. Yeah. And uh, here's the scan code. You have my number. You have Umesh's number. You can reach out to either of us and say that, you know, this is the call I'm going for, guys. Um, let's say you pick diabetes. So then you just tell us I'm going for diabetes and you can make your payment as per that. Right now, for the next three hours, this is your offer. Tadang! Thank you. Thank you, Shivangi. Right. Hope that makes everybody clear about... Uh, what we are sharing now if you have questions around what this call will be how this call will be what do you want yes go ahead Neha we have a couple of questions I think Neha yeah. and Sara have raised their hands yes Neha go ahead so go my ahead. first question would be uh, that uh, live call is important to attend karna or recordings will work as well of course recordings always work when you listen and because of the questions but if you are live there then your questions are taken care or you can send us if you know you're going to not be on the call, you can send us a question a week earlier. Oh, thank you. That's all. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, Tara. I can't see the screen. Um, uh, Shivangi, can you take the thing off? Yeah, now we can see. Who's next? Uh, Umesh, you were I... saying something? Yeah, I was saying, and even after if missing or even after attending, if you listen to the calls and have the questions, you can put up in the group also. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah, and I'll be sharing this in a PDF 
format with all of you on the WhatsApp group. So don't worry about, okay, I didn't notice when is that call happening. Don't worry about that. Yeah. Yes, Tara, go ahead. Tara is just excited to have these two, you know, bombastic, <laughs> you know, blasting the world <laughs> and blasting diseases. So I'm so Thank excited. You. Thank <laughs> you. Thank you, Tara. I'm Always really support. excited. Thank you. Awesome, awesome. company. How does self back from self and other impact our health? It is depends how how interested you are in that people, how connected you are with them, what do they mean, what does that disease mean to you, Neil? So it is a lot. Yes, it can impact you terribly, but it is only your point of view that will make you go through it. Yeah. Anybody has any other questions for themselves? Um, hmm. a lot okay. of heaviness in my office as soon as yeah. we started this call it just okay. yeah what is it what can we do for you feel it I think I pick up a lot of energies from my mother okay and oh, then what do we do here do we send yeah, it back or do we holding it uh, yeah, I think we should do a lot of work. Since morning we had that SOP session, it's showing, it's show, showing up a lot. I mean, my body is showing up, my mind is showing up, my chest is showing up, my back is showing up. Yeah, I mean, this is how beautiful example that Jasmine is being that how what Neeraj also asked that can we catch up? Yes, we can catch up. This is how it, and now when you, we've been going through this, the symphony of the possibility sessions that we are going through, you're getting more, you know, present with your bodies and it's amazing that the Justini can actually acknowledge that oh, kabhi aur hai, kabhi aur hai, kabhi aur hai. how much everybody is shouldering and how much when she is moving in the world or even if she's thinking about them, she's picking their issues and body showing that it's coming here. It's in her head or on her head or on her head or on her head or on her problem or on her body is trying to communicate. But as you make it your own, that is when you have formed it. Oh, my mom has cancer, I don't have cancer. You've created right there and there. Rather than, oh, that's my mom's. Okay, buddy. We're not creating it. Okay. What about diabetic? And yeah, we will be talking more. You can join the call for that, Joy, if you're interested. Um, Should I say timings is 6 to 7.30? Yes. Yes, probably it'll be around that time. 6 to 7.30 is a great time because mostly people are free there. Right? Great. And awesome. also like to share when Madam, yeah. when Kate said it so can relate to how it works and what it changes. As I was sharing about that hey, diabetes is somewhere we give our happiness. So just referring to that, I would just like to share one of my client story. Well of how it worked or how, and how it helped. So she was around 20 years old when I had well started to heal her and it was she was suffering from it almost from 13 to 14 years well, she was suffering yeah. from diabetes and she used to have two insulins a day at that time and when i worked at con we started with case she realized well when her, her grandmother passed away at that time and she was loved by her the most in the family it was like she asked and she will get it with Mother, because of her grandmother. Wow. And nobody can deny her wish when she is around. So she was so loved by her and she wasn't worried about any, anyone else when she was around her. So when she died, it was her world got over. There's nobody is going she was she won't be loved in this life like her. And in that moment she thought and took it as okay, there's no happiness in the life. Wow. Yeah. Oh, it's after recent... that, it was yeah. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Finish. 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 Sorry. Okay. Yeah, so there were people. It wasn't like the happiness was over. Then only we get malab diseases. But it was for her in that moment. She took it in that way. And her parents were taking very good care. But the moment they say no for anything, or they didn't fulfill their wish at that time, or to take time, so she is. She was repairing in her mind as to see. She wasn't taken care of. Nobody loves her. Yeah. And that started building up the diabetes within two to three year, years. And she started well, 
the symptoms showing up in body and year by year it was getting worse and worse and when we said it it is like reverse like magic so today she doesn't have to take any medicine it is almost 6 years now i had already she was getting cured completely yes and there it is, are it is beautifully yeah. magical yes it is how simple how such a clear small things but how it impact our mind and how we react yeah it's very different and so different. guys if you believe in magic and you think that can be magical and you can change and reverse your things in your world and if it is light in your world this is a platform we are offering. We have seen many changes, many stuff. Yet we are referring to you that we are not medical doctors. We are not into it. I'm just a daughter of a medical doctor. <laughs> and a sister. I'm a medical family history. And yet I have seen uh, examples. And I still, my brother, and we consult a lot. And we talk about it. And um, and looking at my results, my brother is like now, sometimes he's like, mm. I'm also becoming a Babaji like you. You become a Babi. I say, okay, you also become a Baba. She's like, she's like, yeah. She's like, I say, yeah, thank you for calling me Babi. And I like that new name from Ma to Babi. And what else is possible? But yes, having said that, done, I'm telling you, I looking at people also, you can so see that, you know, you can change this. Try just one this point of view, like what Umesh just shared. I am forgetting now, somebody in the class yesterday or SOP session was there who was actually by making somebody who just passed away and i just said that and changed yesterday something who was there i don't remember now but it was so there That's in the call yesterday the me listen was it you no mukta was there mukta said mukta was there yeah yeah mukta was there and it just it did not shift mukta it did right it was like yes. it was in a panic moment and it just striked me and i was like okay this is coming in so I think how can we use our um, um, gifts to your advantage and we can offer you this. And I think this is nothing. If it feels light at all, we are not forcing you into it. We are just inviting you into the space. If that feels light, please join us. We'll be happy to cure it, work with you. And we'll be more happy. We will get, the, we are very excited for this. And I know we can yes. create magic together. Yes, Shivangi, you want to say something? Yeah, I just wanted to add that recently I did a research project and uh, this was about, uh, you know, psychosomatic issues and which kind of included everything starting from a nail fungus to cancer to Parkinson's and uh, all kind of crazy diseases that you can think of and all kind of like smallest of things that we kind of deal with in our everyday lives. And the study was about how energy healing modalities are contributing to, uh, you know, giving relief from these. So, though, yes, you know, we are not professional doctors, but here we are, um, you know, with this program, we, we, we are extending an invitation that, you know, how we can change our energy, the way we engage with things and <laughs> The attitude that we have towards them and just with one single point of view you can reverse a lot of these problems that are showing up in your body yeah, yeah. and in a very beautiful like it, it can't harm you for sure it will only bring you better so you've tried so many things you've run so so do this and maybe it changes your world and yes there are a lot of uh issues that we have covered there are a lot of other things we have it. maybe we come into the next series of it but yes for now these are the topics that we are covering and in these topics where we both go we wonder we are yeah. clueless we don't have any form structure both of us so that's the truth so one session might be only maybe umesh taking over totally and one session probably i'll be taking over we do not know how we're gonna work we have no form structure to it yeah, we yeah, just got really really excited. two sessions too yeah. <laughs> no wonder what else is possible. <laughs> and now Nita has asked just kind of reason for anxiety and depression and vertigo and panic attack. So it is like the reason for anxiety and depression is somewhere we are unsure about and expecting uh, some results in a particular way yes, or trying to get attention to. Same yeah. with panic attack and vertigo too okay, when we are somewhere fearful of and not sure somewhere we are 
almost decided that we are going to fail yeah, or it's going to be very tough to be can you okay. mute you sorry sorry umesh jispinder yeah. can you mute you jispinder bakshi sorry sorry sorry, sorry. lot of noise sorry Go ahead. Yeah, now. Oh, very good. Panic attack. Somewhere we have already decided in our mind that it is going to be very tough for us to get over the, well, of situations or things or person. In that case, whenever we face that, we will go into the world to go or in panic attacks. Well, the core of it is going to be that the emotions can be shown in a very different way, but when we focus on that, and it will lead us to that. I don't think we're covering blood pressure, are we? No, no. We will do it in the next series because how many diseases is like endless. <laughs> but you know, but sometimes, you. but I'm telling you guys, it's not about the particular name of the disease. You yes. do not know which call, what will actually open you up. Yes. So you you might be thinking it's a blood pressure, but the cause might be an acidity. It might be an acidity, but you know, <laughs> these are just the names. It's just the name. Yes. It's the energy of the class. So don't just go by the name if it feels light. Any of the names go through it. Any of the names feel light. If you just want to do one call, go with it. Trust mm -hmm. your knowing. Yes, mm -hmm. Gaurav, go ahead. Uh, hi, ma'am. Hi. Hello. Very good evening. Yeah. Hey, Gaurav. So, uh, I'll say a little bit in Hindi. Yeah, that will. I, I Aha, might, pura I, bolo. Hindi me bolo. Why not? So actually, uh, my question here is: I have a knowing. I know something that uh, this is going to happen or that is going to happen. Basically, something related to um physical abuse, like something like that, that is going to happen to me hmm. because sort of things are happening. Uh, mm. around my uh, neighborhood which is mm. I mean completely uh, out of the box and like uh, mm. I, I feel like there are specific people that are after me mm. so because of which what has uh, I mean because of this knowing so the question here is we cannot I mean uh, clear the knowing right Do you, like how many, how, how many tools or something any Whatever you cannot clear the knowing. It is a knowing, but the, what is the awareness here? What else is possible? What can I do here? What is it? There is a question to ask. Mm -hmm. This is a, also this is a conclusion that knowing. Okay, if the knowing is coming, what is this knowing coming to me for? If you're knowing it, can I do something about it? Yes and no. Go with your lightness. Yes, show me universe. What is it? Yeah. So. Uh... If I question, ask question yeah, like, and question. Yeah, so the only thing... Uh, <laughs> and can anyone abuse you? Can anyone abuse you? What have you defined abuse of as? Of course, Gaurav, you do all abuse. You are so much abuse. Right, Gaurav? Gaurav so, has no power. It is not how we have decided. Yeah. It is like how we have decided. decided. The thing as why I was sharing that okay, how we yeah. perceive it in the in our mind, how we have taken it. That is so how so just our body reflects as a pain, as a disease, or as a discomfort. Yeah. Yeah. Whether we have decided this means abuse, this means pain, so it shows in it in our yeah. body as a pain or disease. So, so um, because of that, I mean, I am not able to. I mean. Sleep, sleep near. I'm not able to sleep and all sort of panic. And, you, I think uh, we have the sleep apnea call or something yes. we are doing, yes, right? Definitely. You can join that if it calls you for that. We'll talk more in detail there. Yeah. So we'll begin to close. Yes, Parth, last question. Go ahead. Hey, hi. Hi, how uh, are you doing? So good to I'm see you. I'm doing great. Ages. How are you? Good, good, Parth. So I had uh, like I had allerg skin allergy started around two years ago, and it comes and it goes. And like I said, like whenever I, exa I have exams, it comes and it goes. But right now it's getting worse. Like I like I started taking steroids like two to three days ago right now because of it. Mm. And mm. you know the most strong medication I'm taking, the more it is reacting to my body. Mm. Mm. So like. So what no. the question? Uh, like, <laughs> Deepal is already telling yes, the question. Uh, yes. <laughs> so like what questions? Like I'm planning to join the allergy call. 
Yeah. Like, what questions? But it's in July. Yeah. So, like, what so what is this? Can what can I, I do with it? What is this? What can I, I did do everything. with it? You know. So I don't have, look like, for an answer. Trust and know. And um, um, I think Umesh, do you want to give him one, one, uh, thing to play? Meanwhile. Yes, but I require, uh, it will take five minutes for me to go a bit deeper with that. Yeah, and go ahead. Let's take five <laughs> minutes and last and then we're closing down. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, uh, so, Pat, when you say it, when you are taking medicines or the more you focus, the more you are getting allergic to. Uh, in which circumstances do you take medicines? Like, whenever I have hives, so I have hives. So, whenever red spots show up and you know, they start burning. I like actually right now I take the medicine daily, like thrice or four times. Okay. Uh -huh. So what are you irritated about or with? What is the first thing that comes to your mind? Myself. Okay. And he's not good I... enough. Yeah. What are you irritated yeah. about yourself? <laughs> he's not, he's good, not enough. good enough, do you think? That's what you say. Like kind of like I don't think I'm not good enough, but I think that like, people don't Think I'm good enough. Well, okay. people think they are not. You don't think that you. Oh, I like uh, it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and it, it, what and makes? Uh, yeah, sorry. Go yeah, ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. No, 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 no. Go ahead. Go ahead. You finish this. So what makes you think so? Okay, you are not good enough, or people think that you are not good enough. Like, like they never talk to me. Like, like so basically, I am a, like I am someone like who you know shares everything, like helps them every time. But whenever like there's something that I need help from, you know, they refuse to help or something like that. So it's something like you know, it's like I'm doing everything for you, brother. But you are not showing in better kind of that way. It's not that I'm expecting like from them, but. You know, it's like you know, there's something basic as well. They won't, you know, help in a way that I would. So, hmm. so gussa aata hai, bahut zyada. Gussa aata. Meri tarah se kyun nahi mujhe treat kar rahe ho? Main tumhe aise kar raha hu, tum mujhe aise kyun nahi kar rahe ho? Hai na? Fast. No yeah. irritation at all. No irritation at all, and the irritation is coming up. Are you doing this for them? Huh? Are you doing this for them? No. <laughs> You're doing it for you, na, darling. Yes. Thank you. So stop expecting. They're doing for themselves. You're doing for you. So everywhere you're judging it. Can you? Let that? Yes, like, I, I understand that. Like I get that. that Mitha, you know, um, not... Shivangi, can you mute Smita? Yeah. You know, I get that that they are not like you know. Like I am. I would really like to help them. But they are not like that. I understand that. But then sometimes, you know, it's like, you know, it's like, you know, it's like, you know, it's like, you know, so, so I, we would, I think we would, this we can keep going on. This is an endless thing. It is, a, again, yeah, that is when we're saying. So, yeah. yeah. So let's just give you a play to it that um, what what will, uh, what will change? Okay. Yeah, what? Go ahead. Finish. Go ahead. Finish, finish. What are you irritated about and be, go deeper, be present with it and keep noting. Well, keep noting everything that comes to your mind and see is it really required to be irritated with? Are you trying to control them? Are you like to well, change them? Are you trying to change, change them? To be okay. in a different way or like that and what are other things? Just, yeah. What you want to say? Yeah. Yeah. No, let it be. He let him question. Thank All you right, much. guys. Thank you. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you, Mesh. Thank you, Arjuna. Thank, Thank you. you, everybody. Yes, guys, we will be looking in forward to see you guys in person and on, on calls, whatever you choose. And a lot of people are asking for cough, this thing, people, uh, the topic that is not covered. Please go with your knowing, follow through the topics and wherever you feel the resonance, uh, like how we do it in the body classes, we pick up the processes. Maybe that really doesn't make sense, but your body is calling for that ailment go there choose that call and you might actually um, open up your receiving with your throat infection or other diseases that are not covered here okay cool yeah. and all if right they are yeah. going to be there we can address that if the question yeah. comes we can let me say yeah that thing because yeah. is going to help contribute to everyone in the yeah
Yeah. So yeah. hope this contributes and hope we see you on the calls. And if not, whatever you could take from this call, please use it, have fun, enjoy it, be kind to your body. And remember everything happening in your body is some information flowing to you that you have converted into a disease. So if you talk to it, question it, you will have the awareness to it. And this part, so, yeah. All right, guys. Thank you. Thank you, Mesh. That was fun. And I'm sure we're looking for more yeah, fun. Yeah, and we'll you, start tomorrow. Yeah. Thank you, everybody. Please feel thank free you, to reach out to me. Yes. Reach out to Shivangi. Shivangi is going to guide you for this. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Thank Hello. You. Uh, Shivangi, you have to cut it down. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Thank you.